Neither Steph or I want to watch this film. We've been avoiding it for the longest time. And I told Steph this morning, I'm like, we're watching Saw. And she's like, I hate you. <laughs> so like, I, I just, I'm, I'm so anxious about what we're going to experience. Maybe I'm overthinking it. You know, typically when I watch one of these, uh, we're watching off Amazon Prime. Normally when I watch one of these things with Steph, I make sure we're watching it through the highest quality possible. It's available in UHD. I'm like, I'm good <laughs> on the regular quality this time around because I don't know. I don't know what to expect, man. Standard definition. Yeah. It's, I don't know what to expect with this movie. I, I mean, I've, I've heard it's good. I just don't want to watch it, but maybe that will make for a better reaction. I don't know. It's just, I really don't like chainsaws in general. I don't like torture porn. Right. Yeah. That's why yeah. I was so drawn away from horror for so long. Mm -hmm. But then I realized there were movies that didn't have it. Saw's not one of them. <laughs> yeah, so I watched, uh, I think, Saw 4. I forget which one. It, there, it had a barn. That's all I remember from the one I saw. And I was just like, that's about what I was expecting. But I heard that this one is more, like, you know, the first one is usually not as bad as the later installments in terms of like just fully aggressive on focusing right. on people getting hurt. Okay. Okay. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Pray for us. Yeah. So you guys, if you're watching on YouTube, you're seeing a cut down version of our reaction as we can only show a limited amount of picture of picture. If you want to watch the whole thing with us without any cuts or interruptions, head over to our Patreon page or become a member of this channel. And you'll get access to the full on cut reaction. You'll just need your own copy of the film. We're watching through Amazon Prime. So you can open it up in an adjacent window to our reaction. We'll give you a three, two, one countdown sync. It's like you're watching it with two of your favorite pals from the internet. If you're watching on Patreon, our memberships already. Thanks so much for supporting us here. If you're watching on YouTube, hit the subscribe button, bell icon, all notifications, and pretty please vote this up. Let YouTube know you're enjoying what you're watching. Here we go. Thunderbolts and lightning. Oh. Very, very frightening. Twisted pictures. All right. Excellent. Uh, <laughs> I'm prepared to be mad. <laughs> even the production company is. Oh, no. That is grody. Disgusting. Okay, I'm gonna take uh -oh. a guess. He's gonna have the option to cut off his leg or something. He just like dropped something though. Help! Is someone there? Oh, you can't see. It's okay, so he's supposed to be pitch black, I guess. Oh. No point in yelling. I already tried that. Turn on the lights! What is that smell? Shh. Hang on a second. I think I found something. Oh my god. My goodness, oh, I'm already- Fluorescent lighting, <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, Carrie Elwes? Holy shit! <laughs> Steph was like, I was having a good morning. I really was. <laughs> I got my yoga in. <laughs> I was listening to Unwritten by <laughs> Natasha Bedingfield on the way here. <laughs> Got one dude is no freaking out, and the other guy's pretty calm. He's already accepted the situation. What's going on here? My name is Lawrence Gordon. I'm a doctor. I just woke up here, just like you. I don't know that actor. Princess Bride, you know him. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Oh, I totally know him. Can you see any scars? What? Huh? This is what they do, man. They kidnap you and drug you. Before you know it, you're lying in a oh bathtub my and your kidneys are on eBay. <laughs> he should take, like, his clothes, make a rope, and try to get the gun. Shoot off the chain. You gonna tell me your name? Or what? Adam. Those pipes look so old. If you yanked hard enough, maybe you could pull yeah. it off. Yeah. That clock. What about it? It's brand new. Somebody obviously wanted us to know the time. I think I might be able to reach the door. I wouldn't want to touch anything in there. It's also gross. <laughs> so gross. Oh, God. <laughs> So far, this is very interesting in terms of like being budget friendly because they've been in the same room. Yeah. Oh God. Oh no. Come on, come on. It's like an escape room. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> no. What is that part of the key? 
That's not gonna happen, dude. Use your shirt. It's, yeah, it's like what you said, yeah. When a body dies, when a person dies, they're, where the body like kind of locks up. Oh, the muscles, like, oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. It won't work. We'll look around there. There must be something else you can use. Rig rigor mortis, is, I think is what it's oh. called, where the body just like gets really solid. Well, that worked out. Yeah. We're gonna have to work together if we want to get out of here. Now, just throw it to me. I'm not gonna risk breaking it. You throw me your tape. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Every day of your working life, you have given people the news that they're gonna die. Now you will be the cause of death. Your aim in this game is to kill Adam. <gasps> oh my gosh. There's a man in the room with you. When there's that much poison in your blood, the only thing left to do is shoot yourself. X marks the spot for the treasure. If you do not kill Adam by six, then Allison and Diana will die. Oh my gosh. And I'll leave you in this room to rot. Let the game begin. Wow. Follow your heart. Me too. The hell does follow your heart? Oh, follow oh. your heart. Okay, gotcha. Oh shit. There. Right next to you. It really is an escape room. Jesus, this is so messed up. No, oh, no, 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 no. Grody, grody, grody. I can't. Oh, Gazooks, this is gross. No. <laughs> oh, jeez. No. Ah. Ah. That's worse than everyone. Oh, my. Yeesh. Good thing I didn't eat breakfast. Oh, God. God damn. Anything? No solids. M maybe it's in the tank. Yeah, what? Why wouldn't that be your first choice? I hope that's not a bag of shit. <laughs> hey, that's the name of the movie. <laughs> god damn it. Oh my god. Mind passing me the other one? <sighs> really? Aren't you supposed to kill each other? But they still think it's a joke. Oh my god. Oh god. You know what they're supposed to do? They're supposed to cut their own limb off. Oh god. He doesn't want us to cut through our chains. He wants us to cut through our feet. That's gross. Oh. He's a doctor, so he might feel more comfortable with it. I think I may know who's done this to us. Police still hadn't caught him. The only reason I know that is because I was a suspect. Oh, that dude. Whoa. You ran a straight razor across your wrist. Did you cut yourself because you truly wanted to die, or did you just want some attention? What the heck? Find the path through the razor wire to the door, but hurry at three o'clock. Oh my god. How much blood will you shed to stay alive? <laughs> uh. Oh! Jigsaw piece. The newspapers started calling him. The Jigsaw Killer. Actually, not really a murderer. He never killed anyone. He finds ways for his victims to kill themselves. Why were you a suspect? The antidote is inside the safe. Ah! The combination to the safe is written on the wall. Oh my gosh. Jesus. Only this time, he left us his pen light. Was that on purpose? Get a rush on the prince. Copy that. Uh, probably. Anyone this detailed. <laughs> Continuing on, the patient had... Girl! She's cute. <laughs> <laughs> this is the workplace. Yeah. <laughs> so you have no idea how your pen light showed up at the murder scene? Of course not, Brett. You have to ask. What were you doing last night? Oh, he put his prints on it. He was giving him a cl them a clue who his next victim is. I was seeing someone. Oh, he's having an affair. Who? The doctor. The, the Asian nurse. doctor. The Asian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Checked your alibi. It holds up. Good. Can I go home now? We have one of the victims who managed to escape. Oh my gosh. Tell me the first thing you remember. She looks malnourished. Yeah. I woke up. 
All I could taste was blood. Oh. And metal. Oh. This guy. This is the guy. That's very comforting. Hello, Amanda. I want to play a game. It's a nice mask, sir. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The device you're wearing is hooked into your upper and lower jaws. When the timer in the back goes off, your mouth will be permanently ripped. What the heck? Oh, this movie's making me nauseous. There is only one key to open the device. It's in the stomach of your dead cellmate. Oh, God. You better hurry up. Live or die. Make your choice. Go, girl! That's so scary. How is she supposed to get it out? <laughs> this is why I have my nails, you guys. <laughs> Just in case, you ever get caught? By Jigsaw. By Jigsaw. Woo! It was a knife. <laughs> oh, this was a knife. <laughs> Oh god, this is disgusting. But at least, I would way rather her situation than everyone else's. Well, so far. So far. Oh, he's alive! He's not dead! <laughs> Poor thing, never mind. She had to murder to get free. What happened after you took it off? Ah! Ah! Why, God, why? Holy... Most people are so ungrateful to be alive. But not you. Not anymore. Oh, that's what this is about? You are, in fact, a drug addict. Isn't that right, Mandy? And you think this is gonna cure her addiction? Sounds like abuse. <laughs> Abusive coercion. <laughs> she still looks like she's injecting, though. Is she just that's, saying that because she's scared? Or are those just scars, Those probably? are probably scars, yeah. Those are probably just scars from usage. Helped you. Girl, you don't look good. I don't think... How do I know you're telling the truth? You can be the one who put me in this room! He's giving Luke Skywalker <laughs> a new hope. I just want to get power converters! <laughs> Dad! <laughs> what? It's too way near. <clears throat> Oi. That's a really wide angle lens. He told us to find an X. That X has to be somewhere in this room. Help me find it. Your wife and kid are out there. He's got them, too. I've been thinking about the last thing I said to my daughter. Okay. That was a total misdirect. I thought there was going to be someone yeah, there watching her or something. Right. Did you ever sleep with a stuffed animal? Not a snake. <laughs> but a teddy bear. Yeah. She had a snake right over her bed. I'm like, why would you have that there? That's so unsettling. I mean, snakes have always been portrayed as bad. Yeah. You're cheating on this hot of a wife? No wonder Jigsaw wants your ungrateful little touche. There's a man in my room. He talked to me. Uh-oh. Sounds pretty serious, Mom. I'll come and check your room. I want Daddy. He'll get the scary man. He's a, he's a torture expert and a babysitter. No kid is going to lie and say a man is talking to them in their room. If they are, there's a psychosis going on. Mm -hmm. it's, either way, it's a serious problem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's no such thing as the bad man. Now, can it's you not true. <laughs> it's not true. Why would you ever teach your child that? There are bad men and women and people. <laughs> you just have to be cautious. I hate that thing. Well, I have to go to work. Remember pagers? <laughs> Do people see, still use those? No. You're not going to leave us, are you, Daddy? You mean leave you and Mommy? Her intuition is strong. She Kids knows, know. Yeah, she knows what's going on. How much do I love you? Love you very, very much. much. That's right. That's right. We should go old school stuff. 
What? Get a pager. Oh, yeah. CD Walkman. Yes. And daddy, one more thing. Keep it in your pants. Yeah. Right. God, that's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a whore of a father, daddy, please. Would you like to see her? How does he know his wallet is how he left it? You guys aren't doing enough escape room tactics. He has to hold a camera, which means I'm always missing from the photos. Mm -mm. Uh-oh. <gasps> Sometimes you see more with your eyes shut. What? <sighs> this photo you're talking about's not here. Are you sure? Did he, Did he take it? I'd rather you break down and tell me that you hated me, at least there'd be some passion in it. They look like siblings, though. Keep it in the family. Yeah. Keep that blood blue. Yes. <laughs> we need Aryan children. <laughs> oh. There was someone there. There you go again, gaslighting your child when she was right. You didn't check the closet. This is Parenting 101. Hi, little girl. Oh, Jesus. <gasps> Ugh. How'd you get out of there? Oh, whoa. <laughs> what did that little girl do to deserve this? I know. Just be his daughter. <laughs> that heart rate is unrealistic. Yeah. <laughs> see, this is, this is, this is torture porn. <laughs> Wait, what? I never should let you go. He's tracking him. Oh. Oh, this grouping almost feels like um it's low key uh like seven, like uh, Morgan Freeman oh, and Brad Pitt. Oh yeah. Remember 118th Street? K2K. That gang's territory was only about four blocks. Now listen to this. You gotta check the records for all the fire emergencies that occurred in that area within the last two weeks. Go, right now! They're not gonna catch no. him. No. What it must have been like to watch this film before like the 18 other Saw movies came right. out. Right. Darkness. Yeah, well so will anybody else. Oh no, maybe they're being lured in. Yeah, and they haven't even told anyone where they're going. Cause that's good police work. <laughs> you just keep it to yourself. Yeah. Oh, oh he no. planned this whole thing out like that. Oh, that's them. That's the current one, yeah. Yeah. <sighs> you guys should leave and plant cameras and things. That's a great idea. <gasps> But more than likely, there's already cameras watching them. Let's see what he's gonna do. Why? We f***ing got him! Uh, we don't know what he looks like. Let's see what he's gonna do. No! That's what you said, though. <laughs> Put it all back. Put it all back. Put it all back. Quick. Coming in like a warlock. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just shoot him. Please! Hold it right there, don't move! What the f now you'll make a choice. In 20 seconds, the life of this man will be ended. Shut up and get down here! What you do? Turn it off! Shoot him in the kneecaps! Damn! Which key? Which key? Tell him which key it is! I'm running out. You guys have guns. I'm so confused. <laughs> You're right. Sick of those who scoff at the suffering of others. I'm sick of it all. Oh! Shoot him! Just shoot! shoot. There. Oh, it's someone else. Oh, That's not him. Misdirect. How is he alive? Maybe it wasn't a deep cut. Yeah. No! No! Oh, god damn it. Oh, 
What did that cop do to deserve that? Mm. Oh my god. We're gonna close this case. Right, right, close it. Right, right, see. Right. Damn. Turn off the lights. What? Turn them off now, please. We're gonna look for the X. There's the X. What's it gonna be, Steph? I don't know, like a body part? <laughs> it's not gonna be anything good. No. There's no point in it's having a bomb, hope. bomb, maybe? Because I'm wondering how, like, what's their death contraption? If you watch Seven. Yeah, it is giving Seven vibes. That was a really good movie. What's in the box? It's her head. Oh my god. <laughs> Wrath activated. Oh goodness. Okay, I thought it was gonna be something way worse. Okay. Most beautiful invention on this planet. Mm -hmm. Don't celebrate yet. <gasps> you gonna put something that you found in this room in your mouth? Yes. No. Read the note first. The cigarettes are harmless, I promise. Smoking is only poisonous when it ends in bloodshed. You don't need a gun to kill Adam. I don't get the, the riddle. Like, the, the cigarette has poison in it. So he, said, it he said it's harmless, though. Without bloodshed? Unless I... he's got something in his system. That's how he got drugs. Oh my god. This guy is psychotic. Here it is. Managed to frisbee that pretty well. Yeah. I was surprised it didn't like just <laughs> come right back. I can understand him holding back on giving that to him yeah. though. Because now he'll be more desperate to kill Adam. I'm, I'm, I'm not following the clue. I feel dense. Oh. Oh. Adam, listen to me. I want you to play along with me on this. Yup. You still want that cigarette? Um, yeah. Well, there's two in there. I didn't catch that the first time. Eek. You're gonna put that in your mouth. It's all over that grody floor. Eek. God damn it. Oh. He's faking it. Uh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I oh, fooled he... you too, Steph. <laughs> I thought you just said, like, play along and smoke. Steph! I've done it! I've killed him with the poison, just like you wanted. The phone's gonna ring. I, I just got electrocuted! What? Oh, my God. I remember how I got here. Is he a pervy photo taker or something? Oh. Oh, what? Wait, why would he have a photo of him? It was an assignment. Oh. He probably got paid by Jigsaw to track him. I can hear you. That is properly discomforting. Yeah. Every time it flashes, I'm just like... What are you going to see? Jeez. Uh-oh. Why not get out of there? Man, my instinct is to get outside. Yeah, it's you're obviously in an apartment complex. <laughs> he deserved to get captured walking around with that stupid camera instead of getting outside, trying to buy the flashlight that works. Who is this? Daddy? Oh lord. Don't believe Adam's lies. He knows you. He knew all about you before today. Oh. You don't recall getting your picture taken in that parking lot? You cannot tell me he doesn't look just like Ezra Miller. <laughs> like, he, they do look similar. I get paid to take pictures of rich guys like you who go to seedy out of the way motels to f their secretaries. Last night I went to your house. Just out of curiosity, who what did you do in that motel room? Get out of there pretty fast. It's the it's Asian, Asian girl. It's for you. For me. 
Oh no. I know what you're doing. Doctor. Well, his dumb ass decided to answer the phone. And leave. He should have been like, ask who it is. Yeah. I gotta go. I'm not here. Oh, that's why he was in that CD parking yeah, lot. That's not the hospital. That makes a lot more sense. Tall? Was he skinny? Obese? What? Don't take notes about his appearance. Must remember no way. Detective Tap. Whoa. Oh. The guy who paid me to take these photos was not a cop. No, 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 no. He was, he was discharged. <laughs> Hello? Oh my God. Hello? <laughs> Shoot him. Shoot him. Don't even hesitate. Shoot Just shoot it. him. Give it to me. Shoot him. Shoot his knee at least. Yeah, like anything that can disarm him. Larry. Allie. Call the cops. I'm being held captive in a room somewhere. What, what are you talking about? Put a bullet in his knee now. Oh my gosh. Howie. I'm happy with you. Oh. Let your mother. Ah! Dude, go, go now, go. What are you waiting on? Go. This is your job as a creeper. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, you guys. No. We need no. Oh my god. At least he's been shot or scissored. Oh my God. Lawrence, get up! Oh, thank God. I thought you were dead. He's gonna cut himself free, isn't he? Did you call back up? Well, that's the logical thing. You don't do the logical thing yeah. in these movies. Turn the ball. Yeah, I know. That's what I was thinking too. Turn it over. My anxiety levels are so high right. at the moment. Just know there are people who watch this for fun. Yeah. He's, no! Oh, I thought he said. Sick ass hoe. Oh. <laughs> Lawrence, calm down. What did he say? There must be a way out of here. Oh. oh, sick asshole. Yeah. <laughs> He's sick ass hoe. No! Yeah, your family no! needed you when you were. No! No! In hitting other coochie. Don't do it. Don't do it. He's going crazy. I would, yeah. Lawrence, just calm down. There's a way out of here. There's a way out. Oh, he's going to cut it off. Whatever. to cheating on your wife. I'm not sure. Perhaps there's an argument. I'm going to shock. Oh, no! What are you doing? Oh, my God, he's going to kill him. I want to sorry. I want to live. My family. <laughs> you didn't want to keep that one bullet for Jigsaw? Larry? Did you get through to him? There's still no answer. It's all right. I've called the police. Everything is okay. Yeah. Is it okay? If he had just picked up the phone.
What? He's dead. I'm going to bleed to death. Don't leave me. No. 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 Are you tied up? Ah. I guess it. Uh, <laughs> don't, don't worry. I'll bring someone back. I promise. <laughs> oh my. Can't he use that gun to shoot the lock? Right. I mean, I, I don't know. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh my god, another one. Hello, Mr. Hendel. Or as they called you around the hospital. Zap. I want you to make a choice. Will you murder a mother and her child to save yourself? Oh my god, he's still alive. Oh my god. Oh, oh. my god. Do you still have the gun? Those people are so ungrateful to be alive. Don't lock them in there. But not you. Not anymore. Ah! Game over. Dang. I knew that um, Jeb or whatever the dude was, I knew that he was not Jigsaw. Um, I thought he was in cahoots with him. I didn't yeah. realize he was also being put up to it. Yeah. That's crazy. I didn't see coming that Jigsaw was in the room the entire no, time. Same. That completely caught me off guard. That, uh. that was a real like sixth sense kind of moment. You know what I mean? Right. <laughs> of like the, the, the realization. That's crazy. That wasn't as painful as I was expecting it to be, especially off of like the more recent Saw film that I had seen. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, because it's way more... Where like you watch so many people die from yeah. the traps, Oh, right? it's like really gratuitous. Yeah. Like the whole point is like the torture. Right. You know, whereas this was more of like a psychological... A game. Yeah. I liked how this was more of a psychological thriller and I wish that w whatever I saw some those years back was this was like more like this because this is actually interesting it's very experimental in its approach i mean the editing feels very much of its time you know with the with the ramping of the mo you know when it's like speeding through the film yeah you know with the during the car chase or when the camera's flying around the chair and stuff like that that's very much a style of its era um anyway as someone who never wanted to watch saw how did you feel about it oh my gosh it's a good thriller. One thing I don't like about horror films is sometimes the main villain doesn't real ha have a motive that we know about mm -hmm. or it's as easy as he's a psychopath. Mm -hmm. And to me, I'm like, I want to know a little why. I want to know your reasons. And so with him, you get it. It's like he's targeting all these people who are ungrateful mm -hmm. for their lives in one way or another because he's going to die. Yeah. So I can't. I think the villain itself is more, in, not enjoyable, but interesting. Mm -hmm. And it was like, it was such a great acted film, but it's so scary. It's they, There's nothing good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, the acting was definitely on point, at least for uh, uh, Jigsaw and um, the doctor guy. Yeah. yeah I, the acting from our um, Ezra Miller lookalike, yeah. I was a hit and miss for me. Like, mm -hmm. I guess, you know, he's supposed to be kind of a more of a pansy character. Yeah. And so he was leaning into that. But there were instances where I, th I thought it was overplayed. But in general, like it, it lent itself well enough to this 
story. And from a budget standpoint, I was actually really impressed. I was like, yo, this totally fits in line with what you're supposed to get out of a horror film, which is you're maximizing effect for the smallest cost possible, you know, because you didn't actually see him saw through himself. It was just like, you saw just enough to get the idea, but like, it was the same thing like in Scarface, you know, there was like a chainsaw scene with a guy on, on his head, but all you really saw was blood. You didn't actually see yeah. the contact. Just from a producing standpoint, I thought this was fucking genius. Mm -hmm. Like most of the time they're in that room, chained to the wall, not even moving too much. And so you had to be, James Wan had to be extremely creative with his camera work. How many locations were there really? And they kept revisiting the same locations over and over again you didn't see too much of the hospital it was just that one room you didn't see too much of the police station it was really just like those two three rooms from that perspective i am extremely impressed with what they were able to do with this and then it's you know spun a whole bunch of had a whole bunch of uh, uh what you would call it's afterwards that which got progressively more expensive and etc yeah so yeah it was it was really well shot especially it feels like you should make the movie the same this year that you did that year Yeah. in a lot of ways. And I love that. I thought that it was so, it is very creative in yeah. a very, very dark way. In an upsetting way. In an upsetting way. I'm like mad your brain. Some of our brains go into Alice in Wonderland creation. You're mm -hmm. like, how did you think of that? Yeah. And then they're like, how do we think of the most torturous contraptions of all time and how you oh. must get out of it. Oh, it gets real complicated. Jeez. It gets really, really gross and, and whatnot later on. You know, I thought that this was going to go a different... Let me just explain where I'm coming from. So when I saw the other Saw film, what you find out is the characters you're following are all criminals. Mm. But you don't know that when you're watching the movie, but you find out they, they each did something real heinous. Here, it didn't even seem all that, that bad. bad i'm like this is the people you decided to lock up and yeah you know? like they just maybe they don't have the most gratitude for their life but yeah. they're not killing people or torturing people yeah the music was good too it definitely set a gritty dark disturbing kind of tone with the music and the way it's shot and the set design and whatnot. They did a great job of, of bringing you into this world and making you feel uncomfortable. I felt bad for Danny Glover. It's like, at least from Jigsaw's perspective, I wanted a reason why Danny Glover and his partner deserved to die because I really didn't see one. Yeah. You know, it, it's like, okay, so there's this dance between characters simply dying because they are hot on the tail of the uh, villain and characters dying or being tortured because they deserve it. Yeah. And it's a little bit muddied in that way. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's the one thing that kind of bothered me because I was like, w what did he do wrong? Like he was doing his job to his detriment. You know, he was so obsessed with getting this done, with doing the right thing. Why did he deserve to die? Right. That kind of upset me. Yeah. Um, it, not upset like, I'm so upset, but just like, it was like, that didn't seem right. It was a little bit confusing in terms of like the moral of you know what's happening in this right, movie right so i'd like the little girl being tied up and whatnot i get that she was um supposed to be leverage uh, well yeah like cannon fodder for this the, the circumstance but like i didn't imagine that jigsaw would actually go all the way for some reason with hurting the wife and daughter because she didn't they didn't actually do anything wrong and so i really don't know the line for jigsaw you know right it's but, yeah, they didn't do anything wrong. They've just been kind of wronged by yeah. the man of the house, yeah, which is unfair. Yeah, exactly. But it was interesting to say the least. Like, it was an interesting premise. Uh, it definitely, you know, puts you in, in, in that seat and makes you think, like, what would I do if I was in that same circumstance? And that's the great thing about this kind of movie is it makes you kind of ask that question. Almost like, would you rather get kicked in the nuts or, you know, punched in the teeth? You know what I mean? Like those kinds yeah. of dumb questions. How would you rather die? And like right. that kind of stuff. It's like the movie is just that. It's like, how would you, what would you rather do in any given instance? It's an uncomfortable question that hopefully none of you guys ever have to go through. I mean, I, so, I suppose that's the sort of a weird, dark, twisted escapism of it. Yeah, at least you chopping know? off his foot wasn't done in vain. Hopefully not. Because, well, yeah, we don't know if he survived, but no. that guy would have woken up and killed him. Yeah, that's true. I, I imagine Jigsaw ran after yeah. him. Yeah. Oh. You know. <laughs> but it was a cool reveal at the end. 
That was a super, super cool reveal. When he pulled that shit off his head, I was like, oh my God, that like legit shocked me. I did not see that coming. Yeah. So good on you, movie. Hopefully you guys enjoyed our reaction. And um, there you go. Happy Halloween or whatever <laughs> Jabby Koi this is. Like, are you guys okay? I'm Steph Sabra. <laughs> <laughs> Peace out.